All right, today, I'm going to show you how to make your background move like this using the replicate effect in Premiere Pro. First, drag your clip, photo, or logo onto the timeline. In my case, I'll be using the YouTube logo, but you can use whatever you like. Now, important step here, drag it onto layer 2 instead of layer 1. You'll see why in just a second. Next, we need to create a color mat for the background, whatever fits your style. But for this tutorial, I'll go with white since it makes everything pop. To do this, go to the project panel, click new item color mat, select your color, and drag it onto layer 1 below your logo or image. Now comes the fun part. Head over to the effects panel and search for replicate. Drag that onto your logo or image on layer 2, and boom. Your image is now duplicated across the screen. By default, Premiere will split it into four panels, but you can increase this number for a crazier look. Play around and see what works best for your project. I will put mine to eight. Next, let's bring the background to life by adding the offset effect. Search for offset in the effects panel and drop it onto your clip. Now, this is where the magic happens. Try adding keyframes to create a smooth looping motion. Here's how. Set a keyframe at the beginning of your clip. Move the playhead to the end, then adjust the value, either increasing or decreasing it, depending on which direction you want the background to move. It's totally up to you. Left, right, up, down, diagonal, whatever fits your style. But we're not done yet. For an even smoother animation, go to your effect controls. Find the keyframes you just added, right-click, and select Ease In and Ease Out. This will make the motion feel way more natural and polished. And just like that, you've got a dynamic, eye-catching animated background in Premiere Pro. Give this a shot and let me know how it works for you. Catch you in the next one!